In front of the Polytechnic School of Athens is Maria Kalegero Polu, an engineering student driving Piaphoros, a prototype electric car, out of the school's laboratory, which is considered an icon in Greece. American electric car company Tesla, having heard of the exploits of the engineering students, has set up a research and development office in the country. We are very excited that uh, Tesla decided to, to move to Democritos, one of the most uh, elite, I would say, uh, research R&D departments, uh, the, the department for the design of uh, the electric motors of Tesla, the new generation of electric motors. So um, this department will, will come uh, in the campus of Democritos, that's what Tesla Greece is going to do. Uh, and uh, is expected, of course, to, to accelerate the, the company's plans for the, for the future generation of their motors. As a symbol of the future, Piafaros has already won several awards in recent years at Shell's European Eco Marathon competition, a competition that consists of traveling the longest distance with less energy. Its reputation has already allowed many Greek engineers to be hired in Palo Alto, California, at the headquarters of Tesla, the electric car manufacturer. And this uh, vote of confidence uh, of Tesla uh, to Greece has exactly to do with the, with the scientific, the intellectual capital of the country. Uh, Tesla recognizes that they can find uh, a lot of talent here in Greece and this is exactly what they're taking advantage of. The creation of a research and development center for its engines at the Democritos National Research Center near Athens announced at the end of February by Tesla, is seen as an important investment for the country which is emerging from recession. There are many uh, students uh, that have uh, uh, finished their studies in our school and in particular in the uh, Prometheus team that uh, have been implemented by Tesla and uh, had uh, reached uh, big successes in uh, the electrical automotive industry. Tesla will hire some 40 Greek engineers currently working abroad, a very positive step to offset the brain drain that the country suffered during the economic crisis.